Hey guys, if your Razer mouse is either lagging, freezing, stuttering, or just not working in general, then keep watching as in this video, I'll show you some quick and easy troubleshooting steps. So the very first thing we need to do is go ahead and install Razer Synapse. If you don't already have this tool installed, then all you need to do is head over to an internet browser and from a search engine like Google, we're just gonna go ahead and type in Razer Synapse, then come over to this top search result here and just go ahead and go through the download step to install this onto your computer. If you are using a Razer mouse without Synapse installed, then it is going to hurt the performance of your mouse and it's just generally gonna run quite poorly. So make sure to go ahead and install this. Now, once you have installed Synapse onto your computer, the first thing we need to do is just head over to the settings icon in the top right-hand side here, come over to the about section at the bottom and then just press this check for updates button to ensure we are running the latest version of this software. Then we're gonna go ahead and select this this reset tab and just locate your mouse from this list here and select reset you'll get this confirmation message once again just press reset and this will just reset all of your mouse settings back to their defaults so now that we're working with a blank canvas we can exit out of this menu and from our devices just head over to your mouse from the top here come inside of performance and for the best performance we need to change polling rate from 1000 to 500 and once you've done that we can then check to see if that's now fixed our issue if you still are experiencing issues with your mouse then the next thing i'd recommend doing is just try unplugging your mouse from the usb slot and try inserting it into a different usb slot on your computer once again if that still doesn't fix the issue then what we're going to do is just pick up our mouse a second and come over to the back and i'd recommend cleaning the sensor at the back here so you can do this with something like a cotton bud or something small just make sure to use something soft and don't stick anything sharp in there but you just want to go ahead and clean all of the sensor to make sure there's no dust or debris stuck inside of there and then once you've done that we can re-plug our mouse back into our device now if you have tried cleaning the sensor and also changing the usb port then another thing we can do is head over to the start menu and search for device manager. Click on the device manager window. And from here, we need to come down to mice and other pointing devices and expand this drop down. Right click on your Razer mouse and come into update driver and then press search automatically for drivers. Now just ensure that you are running the latest driver for your device. As you can see, I'm all up to date here so we can close out of this window. And finally, if that still hasn't fixed your issue, the last thing we can do is once again, right click on your device here, come over to uninstall device, and then check this box down here, attempt to remove the driver for this device, go ahead and press uninstall, and then just give this a couple of seconds to uninstall from your device. Once you've finished uninstalling your device, you'll need to restart your computer and once your computer is restarted finally you'll need to unplug your mouse and replug it back in to reinstall the drivers to your pc and it's as simple as that guys hopefully by following all of these steps that's now fixed any issues with your razor mouse if you did find this video helpful then please consider dropping a like and subscribing until next time